Blessed be the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, who is worthy to be praised. My God, Almighty, people of God, people of God. My God, we thank you. Can you all hear me? We thank the Lord God Almighty for that word. So just remember that God is coming through. You don't forget about you. He's coming through. He said, have patience. Just have patience. He's coming through. My God Almighty. And right there, my God Almighty, our ability shows the patience that we can bear to, to hold on to God. Amen. It, patience will help you to have ability in God. For God to come through for you, for, you, for him to fix things for you. Your patient will give you that ability so that he can do more than you can ever imagine or think. What a mighty God. Hallelujah. Can we all, my God Almighty, say deliverance time? Can we all say, my God Almighty, time to, can we all say time to dig out the root? Can we all say, my God Almighty, destroying altar? In Ribia Katoria, Mama Seteri Kandorabo Shanda, Ruaba Katoria Baba Shende, Mama Shonde, Ruaba Kataria, Mama Masheke, Mighty, powerful God we serve. Angels bow before him. Heaven and earth adore him. My God Almighty. You know, every time I'm having deliverance day, where I'm doing destroying altar, all I, all I, can, all I can think about people of God, and this is no joke thing. I'm just seeing myself just helping people just helping people just helping people in a way where i'm talking not just destroying altar out of their life but helping people to get back on their feet again i wonder if you all hear what i'm saying entry notice on because these things are my desire these things are my heart desire people Yes. Thank you, Lord. To help people to get back on their feet again in God. And I know God is going to do it. God is going, listen to me. I know God is going to put some people as, as um, what you would call it, some givers for this ministry, some partners to bless this yes. ministry so that this ministry can able my god almighty to help somebody i want to hear what i'm saying Amen. Oh, yes, Lord. and i what i want god to do for this ministry can i speak a little people what i want god to do for this ministry is to use me to help those that nobody want to reach. I wonder if you all hear what I'm saying. Yeah. Yeah. I want God to expose the work of the devil from many that are. You know you have some people. They might be living in some various places where people don't go there. People don't see them. People don't understand what they are going through. A person might see a little house and say, you know, that house there is a little old person live there or is a young man live there, but he's not so right in his head. And their people would be laughing and making, you see, many people would bring people to the, to the house of God and look for help. But I want the Spirit of God to take me to people's house to help them. I want to hear what I'm saying. I don't know if you all get what I'm saying, people. I want for God Almighty to wake me up in the midnight to one say that I have an assignment, my daughter. There is a place and give me the address and everything and we can go out there and attack that devil and bring down that devil and deliver that person, set them free and have them to live again. I wonder if you hear what God is saying, people. Amen. I want, you know, people of God, I want, just listen to me, the reason why I can speak like this, in the midst of suffering, nobody know about it but God. 
Amen. Only God alone know about the Amen. suffering. I can't help but speak like this. I want people to know that whenever they are giving, they know exactly what their giving is doing. It's not about me buying no pointed, pointing, pointed mouth shoes and the mo the latest this, that. And those kind of things don't frighten me. Come on, talk to me. It's not for, because first to comment, I tell people this and nobody don't believe me. I just want to live into a nice ordinary house. I don't want to live into no mansion. I, my mansion will be in heaven. Amen. Come on, people. Amen. Amen. And I'm so serious. Mm. And nobody's going to change my mind. I'm going to live into a nice house. Don't get me wrong. Yeah. But I'm not going to be no ex, go, you know, head over hills and do like many. I don't want that, people. I don't want nothing. That's Mine is muted. Come on, get me right, get me right, Mine somebody. Unmuted. I can't help but talking about these people of God. It's this God that is putting it in my spirit. So let me just speak to get you all in intact with God. So that my God Almighty deliverance can take place more than you can ever imagine or think. Because I want to tell you something. Sometimes you have some people stand in the midst of man or woman of God to get deliverance. But their heart is saying, I wonder if this person can do it because I know this person is not that real. I don't want people to think like that about me. I want people to say, I believe in this woman of God. And I know this woman of God is real. I know this woman of God of the heart of God because look at the things that she's doing for people out there. Come on, people. Amen, amen, amen. Yeah. Yeah. I don't want no anky panky and no this and no that. I can't help but speak about it because people of God, and you know, let me say this to you. Whenever you can see yourself in the midst of going through, things not clear for you, but you're still going through, you're still in the midst of your mess. You're still in the pit. Can a person stay in the pit and think better of somebody than themselves? How many people can do that? Yeah. Come on, people. Come on, people. Can a person? Go, I'm tell, I tell you this, you know. I tell you this, you know, people of God, and you all don't get it yet. Whenever the Lord God Almighty seats fit and ready for me to speak it about my suffering about what i'm going through all through these months and years that you're all with me on this empowerment line the only person a person the only way a person don't cry unless they don't love me that's the only thing i can say Amen. that's the only thing i can say because people of god in the midst of my pit i think about others more than myself Amen. Amen. All of you all get what I'm saying. And that's what the topic is going to be when I'm ready to speak and teach and preach and whatever I have to say. In the midst of my pit, I think about others. Listen to me. God must use me. Even my God Almighty, those that have HIV, and it is the the the, the, the doctor said is um how many days doctor give you, and they said three. I said well, doctor give you three, but God give you none. You're going shall live again. Come on, people, it must happen. What of you hear what I'm saying, people? I want, listen to me, you all don't get it when I call him my bonononos. He's my bonononos. And what bonononos mean? Sister Shavan, shout out and tell him. Because people of God, I hear this word when I was a small child. I didn't know the meaning of it. I didn't know, I didn't even know if it's somebody make it up by cursing bad word or not. But I just felt in my spirit to call him my bonononos. And Sister Shavan happened to go on the computer. And she look up the word because this was a word I believe was created out of Jamaica by some one of those heroes. I don't know. Who was it? Come on, Sister Sharon, help me. I'm not sure who created it, but I was online. They have the different Jamaican, you know, Patois translation. And Bunanunis means plentiful, beautiful. Do you hear that, people? What a name to give my God, my Jesus. 
Yeah. Hear what he is? Plentiful, more beautiful. And listen to me, from the day I started out this line, many of you that started out the line, there you have Sister Babbitt. She's one that was there from day one. She can tell you, I always said, God is the more than enough God. Come on, talk to me. Amen. Yeah. 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 That's a word the Holy Ghost put in my spirit. And because I know that he's the more than enough God, I think about people more than myself. Come on, people. Amen. Amen. I want to see God move in this ministry for people. I want to see God move. People that are going through, struggling and don't have. I must able my God Almighty to get that help to help them. I want to hear what I'm saying. Yeah, amen. Amen. I want to be hard hear what I'm saying, oh, people. Jesus. God must be glorified through this ministry. In the name of Jesus. I don't know about nobody, people of God, but that's where my heart is right at this moment. God. And it's listen to me. This ministry is not about my God Almighty, me padding and getting family upright and others I ignore them. I'm not into that. <laughs> No. I want you all hear what I'm saying, people, because you have many people that will do these things. They and their family will lavish and live after what God is giving. God has people giving into the ministry while others are suffering. Come on, people. It's true. That's yeah. true, my God. While others are suffering. Just imagine, my God Almighty, you have some people in ministry. Where the my God Almighty, people giving in to them. You have that God Almighty, they little young boy and young girl. They're buying expensive car, give them. While I'm not next family out there, don't have a car. Don't even have a car. No. Don't even have a car no to sail in when rain falling. Come on, talk to me. Yes, yes. Yes. Can you imagine? People are suffering out there. And I need God. I need God to lead me. I feel the Holy Ghost. Jesus, I love you, God. I love you, my bone and us. I need God, people of God, to lead me in the right pathway where I can see the poor and the needy. I'm not talking about those that have and can hide and pretend to get. Not into that. No, no. I'm going to be hard hear what I'm saying. God must show, the Holy Ghost must what? Show them up. Expose them. Yeah. Expose them people Those that know that they have a kitchen Can cook in And come in Come in my God almighty Every day to look for free food to eat Shame on them Come on say shame on them That's true Shame on them Shame on them I'm talking about my I'm not saying that People around me That is working and so forth Can't eat and drink And I'm not talking about that Because if you're working God say you work you eat Right Yes, yes. But I'm talking about some people that will shut up their door and come to eat and drink when nothing bad is going on. And when ev the thing that I don't like is people coming around scraping and know that they can, my God Almighty, help others and they're scraping for themselves yes. when they have more than enough. Yes. Yeah. I'm asking yeah. God to expose yeah. people. People of God, I can't help it. I can't, can, can I help it while I'm speaking like this? Can, you think I can't help it? I cannot help it but speak this. I want people to understand. This is God. God must bring forth something to touch people hearts so that people can give. Amen. Mm -hmm. yeah. You understand, people of God? So that people can give. I don't want God to send me in a place where many people is going. Like, for instance, you have some place in America here where you find when it come on to a certain holiday, many people go and gather there. No, I want to go into some places where nobody go. Come on, talk to me. Yes, yes, amen. Yes, amen. I want God to lead me in some poor mashed down neighborhood. Come on, talk to me. Yes, Jesus. Yes, Jesus. Yes, to help people. Yes, Lord. To. I feel the Holy Ghost, people. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. I feel the Holy Ghost. I want people to understand. You know, I did not plan this and I did not plan this one bit. It just come out of me. Else I wouldn't bring forth deliverance, this, that, that. But God of me to speak these things so that I can be able to bring out what He want me to bring out. Because many people are saying, oh, not giving nothing. Um, 
I, I give, give, give to my church and that's where I go. I just come on this line every now and then and da 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 da. I'm not trying to, to deceive nobody. I have no time for that. Because I tell you people of God, if you all, whoever don't give, whatever God give to me, I will give to others. You all don't get it yet. Amen. 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 I'm not going to let nobody block another person's blessing. I want if you all hear what I'm speaking. Because you know the type of blessing that God is getting ready to give me, the, the, the blessing that is like a hose. You ever turn on the hose and the water just flowing and can't stop? Yeah. Yeah. I want of you all here, and I'm not talking about you turn it, on, and it on. I'm not talking about you turn it on and then you have to turn it off. I'm talking about the hose that flow, the pipe that keep drifting all these years, and you don't even know about it. You have some because some of you have some house where you have the, the pipe dripping, and you see a water bill come and said, "Wait, how comes my water bill coming so high? You don't know that is a dripping you have. Come on, people. Yeah. That's the type of blessing. It keep coming. It keep flowing. Not even dripping. It must flow. Amen. Entry notice on. Not for me. Not for me. Come on, people. Not for me. But for God's people. I want to be all here what I'm saying. Amen. For God's people. For God's people. Because you have some of you out there that are listening to me right now on this YouTube channel. Right now, some of you out there listening to me on this YouTube channel. Some of you need help. Some of you need to be delivered and set free. Some of you need to live a life again. Live over. You live your better life again because people block and stop many of you out there. Many of you. It's true. Myself, listen to me. Myself has been black and, 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 and stop. But one thing I love about my Bununus, that's the Lord Jesus. You know what he do? In the midst of my blacking and stopping, he build me up for him. Look at that. I don't sit down waste time. I don't sit down waste time. I do not sit down and waste time. I sit down and depend on him to see me through so that I can pray for you. And people of God, I'm telling you, I want to see you. Oh God, you know, the other day me and my daughter was on the road and we were driving and I saw this nice looking caravan. I said, God, you're going to bless me with one of that for the ministry. Yeah, whoever amen. whoever have phone yeah. not moving properly please fix your phone please let me flow let me talk about my bonus business amen i'm telling you people of god when i you know you all know what i'm talking when i said cover caravan yeah yeah you know those yeah. bus house the bus house them people the house them that they fix it up, you have a bathroom, you have every little thing in it, you can take long trip, long journey on the road with them. Yeah, trailer. I want, I need for God to bless the ministry with one of that. For my come to America, I said, I said I need one of that. Because people of God, having such a little, having such a, such a boss, we must have my God Almighty cook meal on it. Cook meal. We must have food on it. So that when we travel, listen, when we travel and meet people, we can stop and bathe them. Stop my God Almighty, put clothes on them and send them on their way. You all don't get it yet. Deliver them and set them free. Yeah. Deliver them and people of God. I want God said to me. You know what God said? God said the ministry must be different. Don't be like the rest of them that just want to cloak up in the sanctuary. Amen. Yes. It must be a ministry like Jesus' ministry where Jesus was going for. Hallelujah. It must be a ministry that can be on the move as well. Come on, people. Amen. Can be on the move. Yes. When God said, My God Almighty is sending us, for instance, where I'm, uh, for instance, just like I'm in Georgia, and God said, Okay, I'm going to send you to New York City. 
and we're driving there in New York City. On the way, we see people, my God Almighty, people that yeah. out of their mind, people that name it, and the Spirit of the Lord God Almighty lead us in the midst. We can be deliver people, bathe them, dress them, feed them, and send them on their way with money in their pocket. Lord. Amen, yeah. Hallelujah, yeah. With money Hallelujah. in their pocket. I want to feel you can't bait somebody somebody that is crazy, you can't send them empty. Come on, people. Huh? No, no. Amen. You put money in their pocket, my God Almighty, and said, Listen, Wait, the Lord. Spirit of the Lord God Almighty said, there are Go. Twenty seven attendees in this conference. Hallelujah. Listen, the Spirit of the Lord God Almighty is saying, Go and get yourself a place. And start life again. Come on, talk to me. Or if so, we get the place, pay for it, and set them on their way. Come on, talk to me. Amen. Amen. Yes. We have no time to, we have no time to coop up and eat up. Listen to me. If whoever working around me don't understand that or whatever we need is in heaven, you can make us, it's not that everyone not going to be okay. Oh, sure for that. Cause you can't put an empty bag to stand up. You're going to be all right. But people must come first where this ministry is concerned. I want to hear you what I'm saying. Amen. Yes. Yeah. I want, I want if you all hear, 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 hear God speak. Yeah. You think it's the woman of God speaking. It's God speaking through the woman of God. Yeah. God is setting the place to let you all know what is in the making. To let some of you out there that have negative thinking to change your mind and give. Give in to the ministry. Amen. Amen. To understand that this ministry is not about me, myself and I. It's about God's people. It's about people to live again. People to rise up again. People to get going. You all hear the many messages, my God Almighty. If you all should check, oh, you have a lot of checking to do. Because we have, my God Almighty, so many hundreds of messages, priors, name it. So you have to go through it. Just put in whatever your heart desire to hear. And you will see what God is doing in this ministry ministry then you all will understand what this ministry is about come on man people must have love and stop doing all these little trick and trade and business listen me I have no time listen me I have no time to go and buy no island talking about I'm going to build a house on it I'm no time for that crap no I can't do that I'm about my father's business. I'm about my father's business. I want of you all hear what I'm talking about, people. I want, I want for, I want for you to help me dream as well. When you hear the dream, you dream as well with it. I want to hear what I'm saying. Amen. I said I want for you all to dream with me. Can you all dream with me, people? Because this is a dream that will come true in Jesus' name. This is a dream that will come through by fire, by power. Nothing can block and stop it as long as there's a God that lives. It must come through. It must come through, people of God, because it is for the poor and needy. What is going on? Somebody else having their service? This is a dream that must come true, people of God. Amen. I'm gonna, I'm gonna deal. This is, this is, this is me. In the midst of me speaking right here, I'm doing deliverance. You all don't get it. I'm freeing up somebody mind. Amen. I am freeing up somebody mind from thinking negative. I'm freeing up somebody mind to think the wrong right way. This is one of the ministry that when people come to church, we're not going to criticize and bring down nobody and tell them they dress like old prostitute or whatever. We're just going to introduce them to the clothes section and say, pick, pick something nice and decent and put it on. Come on, talk to me. We're not going to disgrace and put down people. Oh, you come to church till you dress like or and you want to. No, we're not into them crap. We, whoever, no. my God Almighty, if a person dress certain way, they don't know better. Come on, talk to me. 
They don't know better. So when the love of the Lord Jesus Christ can say to that person, "Come, you, 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 um, you, when the love of the Lord God Almighty can say, "Come, mine unmuted. Come, let us, my God Almighty, dress you." You know what I see? Look, a while ago I can't speak it. I'm here talking about that, and I see my God Almighty, our dear sister Babet, there standing and taking them very lovely and nice, and saying to them, "Come, come, let me come, come. You're gonna bathe, and you, she, oh Jesus uh -huh. Christ, I feel the power of God, Jesus, Je Jesus, 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 Jesus." Yes, God. Oh. Yes. 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 Jesus. Ministry must not just be about the pulpit, preaching the word and doing this, that and the other. Come on people. The word of God must be the number one. But it must be that my God Almighty there is help for the poor and the needy. Come on people. Yes, yes, yes. Amen. There, there must be help for the poor and needy. And when the poor and needy can get help, they will love Jesus more. Come on, talk to me. Yes. This is no joke thing. This is no joke thing. They will love Jesus more. Not just for the fish and bread, Amen. but for my God Almighty to know that He's God and He have them to smile again. Amen. Come on, people. Amen. This is no joke thing. I just feel like my God Almighty, the Lord just put it in my spirit to speak these things, people. Amen. We need people in the ministry that my God Almighty that will able my God Almighty Hallelujah to go to to come in the midst. We call the clean up crew, the clean the clean up crew, and that clean up crew, my God Almighty, we send them on their way, and they go into certain places. You see what God did? God said Jesus Christ sent out the apostles. He sent out the servant of God and tell them to go forth, deliver, set free, and and do for them. Come on, talk to me. Yes, Jesus. Yeah. We need people, my God Almighty, that will go in and don't have no scornful. Uh, all, some of you that scornful, God help you, you can't be around me. Cannot. Yes. Some of you that have this scorny, scorny spirit, please don't, don't even enter if you know you're like that. Don't even try it. Jesus. Because Jesus Christ did not scorn anybody. Amen. That's true. Amen. Amen. You didn't scorn nobody. You better make up your mind to can able to smell stinkness and say, Oh, it's a star apple I'm smelling. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Amen. Smell stinkness and said, Oh, I'm smelling mangoes. Yeah. What if you all get what I'm saying? You better you, you, you all you all better make up your mind to be like this with me in this ministry. Whoever gonna be alongside me. Because we're gonna meet up on some people that don't bathe for so long and they're gonna be stinky. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Why you think Jesus go to the grave of Lazarus and said, Lazarus come forth? Lazarus was stink. Don't that's what the Bible say? Yeah. And don't Jesus go there and call him forth and tell the disciples them to loose him and set him free. Come on, people. So when God used me to deliver them, I said, loose them, set them free. You loose them by scrubbing them down, cutting their ear. Come on, people. Yes. You scrub them, you cut the ear. We're gonna have we're gonna have people that do ear, we're gonna have people barber that cut ear. We're gonna have this kind of people in our midst. Come on, people. God is going to do it. God is going to do it. Bathe them, wash them, people, people of God, you bathe them down, you wash them, you cut their ear, you fix their ear. Oh my God Almighty, whoever want to put on a nice wig, name it. Come on, talk to me. Yes. Whatever, whichever way, God is going to do it. 
and get people going. Come on, people, get people going. Amen. For people to smile again. Lord Jesus Christ, you all don't know the love I carry, people. You all don't even know it. You all don't know it. Thank you, Lord. I wonder if you all get what I'm saying, people. Yes. You yes. all don't get the love that I'm carrying way down in my nitty gritty. Want to hear what I'm saying, people of God? Yes, Lord. Yes, yes, yes. And, 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 and God is so faithful, you know. In the midst of the, of the ministry, God can give us that land. I want if you all hear what I'm saying, to build that ministry, to have that ministry, Amen. people of God, and have, God. have places for people to sleep and eat and name it. Get what I'm saying? Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Get what I'm saying? Because you don't just deliver somebody and just tell them go. Mm -mm. You deliver them, you, you, have, you have people to counsel them. We're going to have counselor. People that can sit and counsel people. Come on, people. People that can counsel them and talk to them and tell them, you know, name it and what have you. We're gonna, we, we, we need God to work it out so that we can f help people to find their family. Those that are crazy, walking on the street for years and don't know where to turn. They can, uh, we can, we can able to help them to find their family and send, Rebe, you shall feel the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. That is so Lord. Uh, I don't know. It seems like nobody not excited about this. These people are not excited about what God is saying. You see, in the midst of your, of you need deliverance, if you can think about someone, God will come to you. He will locate you today. Amen. 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 He will locate you today. Rabba Satoria Bashanda. Want to see God do great and mighty things, people. People of God, this is no joke thing, man. We want to see you can't imagine you can't imagine somebody my god almighty come around and put it at this god forbid somebody else burned down and name it and that person been suffering and no not getting help the way they are to get help and name it and what have you and so we you know the ministry can find that person and take that person my god almighty to places and buy you know take them shopping to buy clothes or if we have clothes we give them clothes or we can my God Almighty set up a little place for them. You can imagine the smile you put on that person's face. Amen. Hallelujah. You can imagine the laughter you give that person. Yes. Amen. Come on, people. Amen. What many people are thinking, I'm not thinking that. Staying up, staying, staying up on the pulpit and shout and care. Come on, that's going to happen. But people of God, you all need to get and understand. We must be able to have staff in different, different areas. I wonder if you hear what I'm saying. Yes. I wonder if you all hear what I'm saying. Amen. This yes. ministry must get to a place where we can be able to pay, pay people to work with the ministry. Come on, talk to me. Yes. I wish if somebody could say, let it be so. Yes. Let it be so. Let it be so. You all don't get it yet. I'm so serious, people. That's where my heart lies right now. That's why, I, that's why, that, this is me. That is the reason why a person like me cannot live in a mansion. I don't want it. I'm telling you all the truth. I can't live into a mansion. I live into a nice, ordinary house. Yes, yes, yes. Because if I live into a mansion, I'm going to be careful. Oh, oh God, the window up there. I, th I think we have to get somebody to clean the windows and clean the chandeliers and clean. I'm not into them crap. Come on, people. That's true, huh? You're right. I'm not into them crap. And then I have to have helper. Helper in the house to do this. Mm -mm -mm -mm. God give me something that me can manage, something comfortable and nice, so that I can be able to focus on His work. Come on, talk to me. Yeah, that's Amen. right. Amen. Amen. Yes, all about Him. Amen. All about Him. Whatever, whatever mansion I'm to get, somebody else will get six hours out of that. Come on, talk to me. Yes. Amen. I want to be hear what I'm saying, people. 
I'm so serious. I am so serious. We can able to send my God Almighty people into different island to help people come on to get themselves like right again even if i if i don't go i can stay right where i am deliver that person and they and people fly out and take care of them come on talk to me right hallelujah yes one of you all hear what i'm saying people let it be so in the name of god yes god this is the dream i have for the ministry yes lord I want you all to understand great things must happen in the life of God's people. That is the reason why God gave me this YouTube channel and said, send it out. Come on, people. You don't see that it is an international yes. thing. You all don't see that it's an international thing. Amen. Not to talk about and uh, not to talk about um people or oh, oh, we are jamaica listen me i don't want nobody come with their foolishness about his jamaican ministry get that out your spirit amen, amen. That's right it's an international it is for the purple the blue the white the pink the black name it the yellow you all name it That's yeah. right. Yeah. Yeah. you all name amen. it amen. just as oh jesus take them in that's how i must do it I must have the ministry of Jesus Christ. Come on, people. Yes, Lord. Amen. Amen. Yes, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. The ministry like Jesus. That's what must happen. Hallelujah. To bring glory and honor to the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. To bring glory and honor to... This is deliverance. You know, you all don't get it yet. Glory be to God. To bring glory and honor to the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. You see what you all don't understand. I love people. I love everybody. I want you all get this. The only thing I tell God I don't like is them insects. I want if you hear what I'm saying. Yes, amen. I'm not into them thing. Mm -mm. I'm not into snake and this and no way. Not me. But when it come on to people, come on people. Yes. Amen. Amen. When it come on to God's people, you all must get and understand what I'm saying. Amen. For God's people to live upright. I need God to prick the heart of some yes. of those people that talking about they dying leave leave money for animal. They need to they need to put some money into the ministry. Come on, talk to me. Amen. So that we can help people. I want to hear what I'm saying. Yes, yes amen. Yes, so that we can help people. Yes, Lord. He said, What is laid up for the unjust is what? For the just. Yes. yes. And yes. God will touch the heart of them out there to give in. And you know why God is going to give them, give in? This ministry will be a ministry. We're not selling no CDs. I tell you all that y'all don't get it. Not selling no CDs unless, listen to this, the only CD will be selling unless I do my singing, all them thing, and books and them thing. Them things are different. I want to hear what I'm saying. Yes. Yes. Amen. But when it come on to the work of God, like the preaching and teaching, people must get those things free, just like how it is on YouTube. People come to the ministry, we have something set up where people can bring their CD and get, the, get it run off on it. I wonder if you all hear what I'm saying. Amen. Yes, yes. It's because freely God give, we're going to give out freely. Come on, people. Yes. Yes. So when people get free, they will give back free. Come on, talk to me. Yes. 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 This is no joke thing, people of God. The dream is big and great. The dream is big and great. It is big and great. When I look in the room the other day, I was preaching, teaching, because it's mostly teaching I do. I, I, I sound like I teach, preach. But I, I would say that I teach, preach. What I mean, I teach and I preach a little. Amen? Amen. Yeah. And Amen. when I was there, my God Almighty, I saw some people, and this is a family, three of them, 
woman and man and, her, and their little girl child. They build a little place like up on t uh, underneath this bridge looking place. Because they're poor, they don't have it, but they get light. The man know to do him thing and name it and they have batteries. They have battery under there and they set up their little thing and so. And people of God, they are listening to the YouTube channel. Can you imagine? That's what I see in the realm of the spirit. While I was while I was teaching, I see that. They are listening to the YouTube channel. People like those that need God to use me to reach and set them up in life. Come on, people. Yes. You have ministry that do, do these things, you know. You have ministry that do these things. Glory be to God. Amen. But as I start out, my God Almighty, with the sanctuary and everything, these things are my heart desire for the ministry. Amen. We can help people to my God Almighty further their education, name it. Understand what I'm saying, people. Amen. This is what we are about. So those that those that understand and know what the ministry is about, when you're saying whatever, you know where you're, you're gonna know exactly and see exactly where your money going. Yes, amen. You all need to get and understand what I'm talking about, people. I'm so serious about this. You all don't know it. I'm so serious. Amen. For the name of the Lord Jesus Christ to be glorified. Amen. All of you all hear what I'm saying? Amen. For the name of the Lord Jesus Christ to be glorified. Yes. It must be so, people. It must be so. It must be so. Valid option. Children that are suffering in sickness, name it and one of you. God must turn their life around. Must. Amen. Heal them, deliver them, and set them free. Let them live again. Amen. These are my heart desire, people. No anky panky nothing. You see, a ministry without without dream cannot stand. It fail. Yes. If you have a ministry without dream, they said where there is no dream, the people would perish. Yes. You, understand, you understand what I'm saying, people? There must yes. be dream. There must be dream. And this dream is very big. This dream is not about, oh, you know, we're setting up ministry. Oh, the choir, and they must dress very, you know, stush and nice. No, we, oh, yeah, people going to look nice. And, but we're not talking about that. That is the least right there. Come on, talk to me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That is the least right there. This ministry is not about a ministry where people run into look a position on the pulpit. That is the least right there. We're not talking about that. We are talking about the people, what ministry is about. Ministry is about helping people to live again. Amen. Spiritually and physically. Spiritually and physically. You all need to get and understand what I'm talking. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. We give God praise, glory. That is what the praise and the worship just did a while ago. When you all were praising and worshiping God. That's what it did. It stirred up my spirit to have me to speak dreams. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Let's go on, people of God. Deliverance.